Make it streaming. We are live. This is just going to be a really short stream video to show a chicken house that I've designed um, to mostly to demonstrate what's in my head um, because trying to explain it verbally or even in pencil and paper is just not working. So I used a milk shape and which is a really old program and that I've been using for about 17 years now to design this wood pallet chicken house. So it's a modular chicken house so you can make multiple sections and add on to it as you get more wood pallets and more materials to make it larger. And so I've already built it all and I'm just going to show how it works. So here's the first piece. And so these so it takes two wood pallets for the floor. And then two for the wall, three for the walls. And so this here and here are the ends, of course, and that's the center divider piece. And then I have some support beams and a crossbar. This crossbar is where the roof pieces will go on. And we've tried to make it so the inside of the house is easily accessible. I kind of don't want these two bars here so we can just walk straight through. But I haven't figured out how to support this side wall very well. So uh, this design may be altered a little bit with feedback on how to make this wall over here more stable. Um, so we have another support here for that beam. And then this is basically the modular design and we can just duplicate this one after another after another to make more. So here's the roof pieces. Missed one. Let's see the other one. So we can just lift this up. And I'm just not clicking when I click it. So those are where the roosts will go. I see it's an empty space here. So if it's next to another wall, these roosts will go onto another pallet wall. And if it's on an end, then it'll just um, be screwed right into a sheet of plywood or maybe another pallet, depending on what we have available. And yeah, this shows a, an outer wall of the pallet, so we can use this um, to block drafts. And this shows how we'll cut out a hole to put in our automatic chicken door from Pull It Shut. It's a Pull It Shut chicken door. My dad used them and I've used them. It's awesome automatic chicken doors and it will fit right in that hole and so the chickens can go in and go to bed every night on their own. And, and this will be the outer wall. So if this was just a single piece then the outer wall would look like this. That is not the one I wanted. Here's the door. There we go. And so this is for when we're trying to get geese to bed or ducks that don't want to go to bed. We're actually going to have a half door on this side and we can chase them in at night. And then they can go to bed. And it'll be easy for us to get them in without having to use a magnet to open the chicken door. Um, the chicken door is actually on the orchard side in our yard and so we have to go all the way through the orchard to get to this. And whereas this will just be out in the field, it's easy for us to access. And so let me show how this is actually. So I did a duplicate of this and put it on. And so it just copied the texture from the wood palette all over everything. But um, these would actually these would actually be wood pellets here and not. Um, fully 
um, coated in plywood because that would be massively expensive um, but we can basically just can keep adding on more and more and more of these um, I can go over here and I can duplicate that again and show you how that would work I have to select it Also have to minimize this sorry and then it goes like that and so we can just add more and more chicken houses and so then we'll have three going across or four and that's how we can make a bigger chicken house one module at a time and the roosts will all be there and connected and that will also allow the roosters to have their own little compartment so they don't fight with each other and um, that's the plan so thanks for watching I hope you have enjoyed this and I hope it explains what I've been trying to say that I would like to have done Yep, I can maximize it so you can see that better. So of course this end over here will have the doors on it. Because I didn't move the door. The door is still in the other position. This would have the door up. So this is why I would also like to have all of this open through the through the walkway so we could actually walk through here easily to clean it out as it is now that's not going to be as easy um, so we need to maybe figure out how to do that um, that's the best I can figure out for now <laughs>